So now let's see how we can use the ink to shape option inside of Microsoft Whiteboard. So if I were to go on to my pen tool right here and then draw out something right here, let's say an oval or a square or a parallelogram right here, nothing happens as you can see right here. But if I were to go around over here on to uh, the settings menu, and then if I were to turn on the ink to shape, then what happens is that as I draw, it'll detect the shape and then turn uh, the, the pen drawing into that particular shape. So if I were to, let's say, for example, draw an oval right here, you can see that it turns into an actual oval right here. If I were to draw a square right here, uh, that is a rectangle because it's not a perfect square. You can see that it turns into a rectangle. Similarly, if I were to make a parallelogram right here, let me try this out again because it was not able to detect it. So I'm just going to go around right here, parallelogram. Let's try to make it right here. And there you go. Triangle. And there you go. So that is how you can see that you can go around and then make out shapes, different shapes right here, as long as it detects it out it turns that out into a shape. So there you go. There's a circle as you can see right there and so forth. Go around and make a triangle right here. That is how it works. So just like this, you can go around and make the shape as you wish. And that is how it converts existing um, like objects into shapes right there. And that is how you can work around with ink to shape inside of Microsoft Whiteboard. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.